Hello, welcome back. Now, um, problem number four says solving uh, equations with grouping symbols or, or, or parentheses, all right? And that's what the parentheses mean. The parentheses mean that those numbers are grouped together, okay? And anything outside of that is, is a common factor uh, of those two numbers, all right? So, um, if the two, uh, so the, the two and the three here, there's no common factor between those two. So I need to get rid of those. I need to get rid of those by distributing. Okay, I can't just get rid of them by dividing or using the multiplication method. So I'm going to distribute, and these both need to be distributed to both terms inside the parentheses. So 2 times 5x is going to give me 10x minus 2 times negative 1 will give me negative 2. And 3 times x will give me 3x. 3 times a positive 11 will give me positive 33. Okay. Now I can combine like terms in my expressions. I have a variable here and a variable there. Again, since they are in different expressions, I need to use my identity properties and get rid of them. I'm going to use the 3x instead of the 10x because that will keep my variable positive. So subtract 3x from both sides. That's going to give me 10 minus 3x will give me 7x minus 2 is equal to 33. Now I have a variable or a constant on the left side, so I'm going to add. That's going to become 7x is equal to 31. I'm going to divide by 7, divide by 7. x is going to be equal to 31 over 7. That is as simplified as it can go. The reason I know it's as simplified as it can go is because the 7 in the uh, denominator is a prime number, so that means that there's no number that will go into 7 other than 1 and 7 into 31 and 7. So we know that that's as far as it can go. We will go into problem number 5 in the next video because we need to talk about identities and no solution. See you then.